hi welcome back to another video we have got a mo you haul today um if you sign up for mo you's oh, i'm so sorry every time i start recording a video that noisy motorbike goes by i swear it's the same one <laughs> right start again um mo you if you sign up to their newsletter they will send you through their newsletter um just to say that um when they've got sales on or when they're releasing new plates etc um you've seen if you haven't in my drawer where my stamping plates are the majority of them are mo you now they're really good quality and i won't buy the full price ones i never do i wait until they drop in price and they have like two pound sales so these plates drop from like six, seven pounds down to two pounds, which I think is a brilliant price. So I will show you what I have bought. Let me bring you down a little bit so you can see. Uh, generally, they do come with a sleeve on. I have had a couple before what I've turned up without a sleeve. Um, all of these have got sleeves on, so um, but I'm not too worried. They'll end up go probably going into a a folder anyway once i've sorted my plates out because at the moment they're just in a box so right so you always get a nice sleeve on it okay and it gives you instructions on the back of that one uh, about removing the blue protection sticker you wouldn't believe the amount of people what have said they've tried to stamp and it doesn't work and the reason why is because they've left the blue sticker on okie dokie so you must remove this they are really easy to remove. I always end up scratching the plate at the corner, but hey ho, I'll just do one. So I've just used a sharp pair of tweezers. And what I always do is lay it down on the flat and pull it off that way. I don't do it mid air because you can bend your plate and what you don't want to do is bend your plate. Okie dokie. Right, so this one is Minimal Collection, and this is plate number seven. I like this one because, let me do that, it's got these on, which are going to be great on a full, very long nail. So that's the reason why I got that. As soon as I saw those, I was like, yeah, got to have that. So all these plates were from their £2 sale. Okay, this one is Fall in Love Collection. It is plate number six. Uh, this one you can layer those leaves up so you would put your base leaf down and you'd go over it with another collar and then you'd put black over the top if you wanted black so to put the veins on the leaf they're all like that which is really nice that one's a moth that one is but I thought that was quite a nice plate to have uh, tropical collection number 11 I like these ones because they were nice, large uh, images. So I'm really happy with that one. This one is Tropical Collection. This one is plate number five. So we've got more different things on there. Peacock feather, uh, a wing, some leaves, a toucan. I like that one well i like them all but this one is the alice collection and this one is number two so this one has got different characters on i thought this was quite good as well you wouldn't get it all on nail but you could put it on and you would probably see the words just about but i thought that was quite quite a, a cute plate uh, flower power collection plate number 22 so this one's a little bit more abstract but these will be quite nice to color in for a short set i mean you could actually continue these as long as you lined it up properly you could re-stamp them again and then we got some trolls so this one is uh, the Trolls Collection. This one is number four. Now these haven't got a blue thing on the front. These have actually got a white one. 
or a clear one I should say but I took one off the other day and they're quite difficult to get off they're very thick there is no chance anything is gonna get through that so this is what your things look like on the back as well aren't they pretty so anyway this one is number four oh my god it's got trolls on it oh, I love that that's that one this one is number six I'm gonna leave the thing on I'm not gonna take it off I don't usually take them off until I use them so that's quite cute I like that one this one is number one that's pretty at the bottom love that one and number two this was the one I took it off the other day and I thought crikey that is thick plastic so that one's quite nice and then I've got the ET collection look how cute they are on the back this one's plate number three And then the last one I got was Atlantis Collection. Oh. This one's plate number one. So we've got various seafaring things. But all these plates were knocked down cheap. Cheap as chips. I'll just show you what these plates have got on the back. one's pretty I like that one the ones with ladies on the front tend to be a lady on the back whereas these ones are all I've got a pretty um a pretty pattern so also on know you you can sign up for their um affiliate link you don't get money for it but you get a voucher so when somebody um buys something via your link you will get five pound off um i think it's five pound off a 30 pound spend so i know somebody used it the other day the other week last week i think it was or the week before and i had a, an email through so whoever that was thank you very much because that five pound will go towards uh, me getting some more plates uh, they also do on there, besides the £2 uh, sale things, they do every so often, more often than not, they do like five plates for a fiver or ten plates for a fiver, 20 plates for £20. So you, you are literally paying a pound a plate. That is where I got the most of my plates from. So it's definitely worth signing up for their newsletter and having a look every so often because you can guarantee there is something on offer um their stamping polish is really nice as well you have to work quite quick with it um it does dry quite swift um but it is nice stuff i did have a load but i gave it to aggie because i bought some born pretty so when that turned up i didn't use my um mo you stuff so i thought it might as well go and be used so that is it <laughs> nice a fairly short one today um but yes i would go and sign up i would if i was you if you've got a channel or uh you put your stuff on instagram it's worth signing up and telling them to click your link put your link in your bio um right i'm gonna leave you in peace uh if you like my video please leave me a thumbs up that would be super if you could and uh, subscribe if you've not already and i will see you next time thank you all for watching bye